If someone goes to space and comes back some years later, would the people on Earth be older than the person who went into space? Or why didn't this happen to Buzz Aldrin and Neil Armstrong? Hello there, I'm Crystal. Well, you want to know about ageing in space? Well, you've come to the right place. There is no magic in space that turns people older or younger. Space is just a vacuum that begins above our atmosphere and extends out for billions of light years in all directions. Space gives you the room to go really fast in ways that can't be done on Earth. And according to the theory of special relativity, time appears to pass more slowly for someone going really fast relative to an observer. This effect is known as time dilation. It is extremely small at the speeds that astronauts travel in space. Apollo astronauts like Buzz Aldrin and Neil Armstrong travelled to the moon in the 1960s and the 70s and experienced time dilation, but this effect was minuscule. The round trip time from Earth to the Moon and back is about 8 days, during which the astronauts experienced a time dilation of about 0.0 on. Too many zeros for me, just look at the video of 18 seconds. This is an imperceptible, ooh, large word, amount and would have no practical effect on the aging of the astronauts. But if astronauts Buzz and Neil went really fast at, say, about 99% of the speed of light, or if they got really close to something with a lot of gravity, like a black hole, their time reference would not slow down. They could check their watches, for example, and it would not change one second, but when they got back to Earth, they would notice that everyone else had got older. That's all part of that special relativity thing that I mentioned earlier. Relativity is just plain weird. However, not having any black holes nearby, just by orbiting Earth. An astronaut will return to Earth and find everyone has aged slightly faster than the astronaut. Because of time dilation caused, not by space, but by going faster than everyone else on the ground. Even GPS satellites depend on that exact time. All of a small atomic clock on board that are adjusted to account for the time dilation. If it's not the case, then your GPS or smartphone will be off by a little bit and a little bit more every day and you'll be completely lost. Hey up! If you've liked this video, don't forget to like and subscribe and let the people at Brett's HQ know about other questions. Thanks, see ya!